in Pekinoti matter, there has never been a commit to warrant. So there's no way Kinoti could go to commit and claim that allow me inside without a commit on warrant. So procedurally, that is the procedure for one to be admitted in any prison in this country. Either accidentally or by design, the court failed or Jimmy Wanjigi failed to extract that order. Number two, this is a civil contempt. is not a criminal uh, sentence. It's a civil matter. So there was need for that committal to be done. Number two, the judge in that warrant is saying that the IG to arrest cannot bring him to court to explain. At the time of sentence, Kinoti was supposed to have been heard, to have explained, and the explanation failed to convince the judge when he is sentenced. Now, if the Inspector General is being told to arrest Kinoti, to bring him to court, to explain, is that a summary or is it a warrant of a committal to prison? So there is a lacuna. Definitely, George Kinoti must move to court. He must move to court. And his lawyers will be preparing to go to court. One, to challenge that he was never heard. You cannot be sentenced when you are called to court to be heard. But factually, George Kinoti was given time. He was never given time to purge the content. He was never given time to mitigate. He was never given time to explain the circumstances. He was never given time to be present at the time of content. He was never given even a chance that once he has been found contemptuous, the option of a fine of Kenya shillings 200,000 is applicable. Kinoti was sentenced to, to imprisonment with that.